My name is Rhonda Jackson. All right, and how did you first hear about Step by Step? Heard about Step by Step while I was attending um, college at University of Kentucky, but I was staying over at Virginia Place. And so one of my neighbors, she attended Step by Step. And so one week she said, hey, Step by Step is going on and you're going to come and check it out. And so that's how I heard about Step by Step. All right. And how has Step by Step helped you personally? Step by Step has helped me um, to be a more open person. I'm typically more of a laid back, quiet, kept to myself type of person. For instance, I moved to Lexington in order to attend at University of Kentucky. And so I didn't know anybody in Lexington. And I had my first daughter when I was 16. So when I came, she came with me. Um, and so I went on campus, took my classes, and then I came on back off of campus um, on into my own little world to take care of my daughter. And so step by step, as I continued to come, you know, I started getting more engaged, more involved, and more open. So now I don't mind walking up to somebody and say, hey, how you doing? What's your name? You know, introducing myself and all that type of stuff. Why, after your first time, did you return to step by step? I returned to step by step immediately after I graduated out of the program because I saw how important the program was. I loved all the volunteers. I loved all the moms. And I saw how Step by Step was really transforming lives um, by teaching moms parenting skills, by teaching young ladies, including myself, how to budget our money. So we weren't going to the um, pay advance places, you know, the tax return places and things like that, and we weren't getting into that debt hole. And so all these different things we learned at Step by Step, so when I graduated, I decided I want to be able to pour into young ladies also. I want to be able to share my story, let them know, you know, I had a daughter at 16, and I still graduated from high school, and actually at this point, I've completed three college programs, and now I'm doing my principalship program. And so letting them know that even though you have kids and you have them young, that's okay. It's still a blessing. I um, mean, you can still go and accomplish awesome things. So I just wanted to pour into others. How would you describe your relationship with Tanya? Um, I love Tanya Tort. She is, she has her hands involved in all kinds of awesome stuff within the community. And so I know if Tanya is involved, that it must be a good thing. Um, and I was here before Tanya, and so when she came along, I felt like she was a great fit. She was able to hold the moms accountable, which many of them needed. Um, they didn't just need a friend. They need somebody to love on them, but they need somebody to say, okay, I need you to buckle down. This is what you need to do now. How are we gonna make that happen um, type of thing? So I love Tanya, and I'm glad that I get to work with her with Step by Step. Step by Step has impacted the community um, because we have a whole lot of young ladies that come into our programs. So they're going out to different high schools and in high school, especially if you're pregnant, you feel like an outsider because um, you're the only one there and it's like, oh, I have a child. And even with myself, you know, I'm glad I didn't show much. So nobody actually knew until after I had my daughter except for my best friend. Um, but nobody else knew because, again, that stigma of, mm, what are you doing? And, you know, you're not going to be successful and things like that. And so I feel like Step by Step has definitely um, helped some of our moms, or if not all our moms, you know, to change that perception about themselves. It gives them that boost and that encouragement that many of them don't even get at home. There's a lot of our moms that are taking care of themselves and even taking care of their younger siblings. Some of them even trying to take care of their parents because their parents may not know, be doing the best job or may not be able to do the best job of that. And so I think Step by Step is definitely building up self-esteem and building up a lot of those skills that a lot of moms could benefit from.